What is this? Like, I told you to clean up. That's like my favorite you... chores. I couldn't find my chubbies. What? I'm sorry. Are you I, kidding I me? I had to find them. I asked you to clean up. Your... You're okay. going over to the guys. Why don't you just make the bed and clean your clothes because it's our okay. room. All right, fine, fine, fine. I will. I'll Martin, clean it up. Martin, please clean just clean up. up your stuff. If like, you will calm down, I'll clean it up. Don't, okay? Please don't tell me to calm down. I just don't think I can do this anymore. Where is this coming from? It's been a lot of things, Martin. We're just two separate people, and I need someone whose lifestyle aligns with mine. You say you're gonna start working out, and then you don't. You say you're gonna be cleaner around the house, and that you're gonna start drinking less, and look what I walk into. I'm sorry, but we're done. What's this about? I told you I wanted to move on. No, we're just too different, Martin. I'm sorry. But I did everything you asked. I'm, I'm tidy. I've been drinking a lot less. I've been going to the gym. But Martin, I never wanted you to do those things for me. I wanted you to do them because you wanted to. Because I was telling you to. I'm sorry. This is a painful lesson. We all have habits we need to change. We all have things we need to work on. But the biggest mistake we can make is to change or work on them just to get someone in our lives or keep someone in our lives or to get someone back into our lives. When we change for others, it's not the same as changing for ourselves. When we change for others, we're now dependent on them to approve, to validate, and to reciprocate with that change. When we change for ourselves, it's sustainable and progressive. Sometimes it takes someone else to make us aware of what we need to change. But then, we need to choose to change for ourselves, not them. When someone leaves, it makes us more aware of our negative habits. But instead of changing to win them back, the only real win is transforming for ourselves. Look at yourself and think, 
What can I change to trust myself more? What can I change to believe in myself more? What can I change to invest in myself more? What do I need to learn to become better for me? Because when you become better for yourself, you'll naturally be better for someone else.